standard form for big numbers. We use standard form to write very big numbers quickly and easily. Look at this number. 7 billion billion billion. It's the number of atoms in your body. There are 27 zeros. This number takes a very long time to write out. So we can use standard form to write it quicker and easier. Let's remind ourselves about powers of 10. 100 equals 10 times 10, which we can also write as 10 squared. A thousand equals 10 times 10 times 10, which we can also write as 10 cubed. 10,000 is 10 times 10 times 10 times 10, which we can write as 10 to the power of 4. Notice that in 100 there are two zeros, and it's equal to 10 to the power of 2. In 1,000 there are three zeros, and it's equal to 10 to the power of 3. 10,000 has four zeros, and it's equal to 10 to the power of 4. A number written in standard form is always a number between 1 and 10, times by 10 to the power of something. What's 400 in standard form? Well, 400 equals 4 times 100, which is equal to 4 times 10 squared. 4 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something. 4 times 10 squared is standard form. What's 6,000 in standard form? 6,000 is 6 times 1,000 which is equal to 6 times 10 cubed. 6 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something. This is standard form. What's 70,000 in standard form? 70,000 is 7 times 10,000, which is equal to 7 times 10 to the power of 4. 7 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something, this is standard form. What's 380 in standard form? Well, first of all I need a number between 1 and 10. So 380 equals 3.8 times 100, which is equal to 3.8 times 10 squared. 3.8 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something, this is standard form. What's 5,600 in standard form? Well first I need a number between 1 and 10, so I can't choose 56, because that's too big. So I need to choose 5.6 times 1,000. That's equal to 5.6 times 10 cubed. 5.6 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something, this is standard form. 830,000. I can't choose 83 because it's bigger than 10, so I need to choose 8.3. 830,000 is 8.3 times 100,000, which is equal to 8.3 times 10 to the power of 5, 8.3 is between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something, this is standard form. 6,450. I can't choose 645, because that's bigger than 10. I can't choose 64.5, because that's bigger than 10. So the number I need to choose is 6.45 times 1,000. That's equal to 6.45 times 10 cubed, 6.45 between 1 and 10, times 10 to the something, this is standard form. 
834,000. What number shall I choose at the front? I can't choose 834 because it's bigger than 10. 83.4 is also bigger than 10. I need to choose 8.34 times 100,000. And that's equal to 8.34 times 10 to the power 5. 2,730,000. What number shall I choose for the front? I can't choose 273. That's too big because it's bigger than 10. I can't choose 27.3. That's bigger than 10. The number I need to choose is 2.73 because that is between 1 and 10. 2.73 times a million equals 2.73 times 10 to the 6. We use standard form to write very big numbers quickly and easily. A number in standard form must be a number between 1 and 10 times 10 to the power something. 